Before you grab your rake or net and head out to catch some blue swimmer crabs, we'd like to remind you of a few rules. With crabs about at the moment, you might have seen our fisheries officers on the state's jetties and beaches. They're there to make sure everyone is doing the right thing. So there will be crabs for everyone in the years to come. One of the things we've noticed is not everyone is sure how to use their measuring gauges to correctly check if their crabs are the legal size. Size limits are important because they make sure different species can breed at least once before being able to be legally caught. Blue swimmer crabs should be measured across the back of their shell, which is called a carapace. The crab must be more than 11 centimetres across when measured from side to side at the base of the largest spines. It is important to note where the measuring device needs to be placed. It is at the base of the largest spines, not at the top. When crabbing, size limits apply across all waters in South Australia, so each crab can be measured. In this instance, you can see that when measured from the base of the largest spine, this one is below the legal limit, so it's back into the water for him. All undersized crabs must be returned to the water immediately. And don't forget, all female crabs with external eggs are also protected and must be returned to the water straight away.